we are in the process of explaining the three methods of estimating national income we have already talked about their origin how did they originate the main points were these are not exactly three methods but three sources of data at income generation level at income distribution level and at income spending level before we take up each method let us talk about two concepts one about industrial sectors you have learned this concept in class 11 also maybe in class 10 also so here you will briefly repeat it the economy from the angle of occupations is divided into three sectors primary sector secondary sector and tertiary sector the literal meaning is primary sector of first importance secondary sector of second importance and tertiary sector of third importance one depends on the other primary sector consists of occupations which exploit natural resources like land and water on land subsoil assets like coal mineral etc below the land forests so all occupations working with the natural resources exploiting natural resources for the purposes of producing goods are called primary sector occupations it consists the main example of primary sector is agriculture and there are certain allied activities iske sath judi hui maybe horticulture or some such things animal husbandry etc these are primary sector then secondary sector transforming goods into goods they mostly take raw material from the primary sector <coughs> and convert it into other goods that is done in the secondary sector for example wheat is produced in the primary sector but preparations of wheat like maida like other things they are produced in the secondary sector the secondary sector transforms goods obtained from the agricultural sector into other goods we call such goods as manufactured goods so the main component the main constituent 